This is Movie Tone. Jeffrey Sumner reporting. Once again, London's Guildhall offered the traditional sequel to a royal tour. Arriving with the Duke, Her Majesty was received by the Lord Mayor, Alderman Cuthbert Ackroyd. First, the Guard of Honour, mounted by the Honourable Artillery Company, was inspected. Then, the Lord Mayor walking beside her, the Queen proceeded to take her place for the luncheon, given by the City of London to welcome home the Royal Travellers. Of course, not only the city, but also the whole country is grateful to the Queen and her husband for the brilliant success of their Nigerian visit. Queen Elizabeth, the Queen Mother, sat next to the Archbishop of Canterbury. Princess Margaret also attended. Sir Winston Churchill was present. Sir Anthony Eden and Earl Attlee. In reply to the royal toast, the Queen addressed the distinguished company. My husband and I have many colourful memories of our visit, which we shall always treasure. I hold myself fortunate to have been born into an age when great distances can be covered with a speed which would have been undreamt of only a few years ago. For this conquest of distance has made it possible for me to see a great number of my peoples and the countries in which they live in the first four years of my reign. When I spoke to the people of Nigeria from Lagos a week ago, I told them of my gratitude for their welcome and their kindness. I would like to repeat those thanks now in this historic guild hall to which so many members of my family have returned from their journeys throughout the Commonwealth. The interests of the people of Nigeria will always be my concern and their health and happiness my earnest prayer.